Hi guys, it's me Andrea and today I'm going to show you how to get my bubble bath back. So, how you know, I was in a car accident two months and a half ago. I tried to hit my legs. I have been lately using the bands in any workout for legs. And today I'm doing a workout for glutes. And I'm doing cursy lunges. Cursy lunges is one of my favorite exercises for glutes. This were your outer part of your leg and of your uh, glutes and it's because this exercise is 100% good for give you the round shape in your glutes. Now, you have to know or learn the technique to go down without hurt your knee because it's really easy to hurt your knee. So you kind of like a, you when you go down, you put your feet a little sideways. It's no, it's no straight. It's a little sideways, so you go kind of sideways back. Also, I try to use bands. It makes it really harder. Like I told you, you always position the bands in different ways that you feel better the force and give you strengthening in the legs like here i put it over my knee and it helped me to feel the strengthening while i do the exercise i i wanted to do a step up and a step up is a really great exercise for growth those glutes so you don't gonna escape a step up because if you don't do a step up you don't gonna grow the, those glutes and you don't gonna get the round form in your glutes now there is different ways to do a step up this is one of the ways that i do this exercise and I usually do with dumbbells, with 20, 20 pounds dumbbell. I cannot use any way, so I don't use anything. Anyway, the uh, bands there, it make harder the exercise and it's pretty way to do and, and have strengthening in your legs. This exercise, I do three sets. And in each set, I do like 30 reps, between 25 and 30 reps. Depends on how tired I am or how uh, capable I can to do more. Uh, but I try always do until failure. So usually I do 30 reps, right? You have also keep your back straight and i do kind of like a kick kick uh back when i go up right so i do it i do it uh, harder the exercise um it's this exercise is pretty good and there is different ways to do also like uh, there i do it really higher but you can do in a little step too but the higher you go the better you work your muscle you know but you had to do or learn really the technique or the movement so you don't gonna hurt your back you don't wanna hurt your knee you don't wanna hurt, hurt any muscle in your body i was kind of like getting really tired i was really fat fatigued with the exercise and then I pass to conventional RDLs that also are pretty good. I usually do this with with a barbell with 60 pounds in each side. But uh, here I don't use in any way. But anyway, going down really slow, tight your muscle, it makes harder and it makes working that muscle right now also you have played with the reps i doing three sets with 30 reps each set and this work pretty good my muscle you can like fatigue my muscle like i get tired 
it slow my muscle because my muscle get really tired and you have keep going don't stop work until failure and then you wanna feel that muscle is going to grow up you have to really push you, you, yourself to work harder then i go to do a side leg raises this is a pretty good exercise that were your outer part of your leg right and also it help you to give that round shape of your glutes and uh, i do this exercise also until failure kind of like i do 30 reps kind of always because i don't use uh weight right if i using weight probably i would do reps until 20 or sometimes 25 or sometimes 15 because he's too heavy for me you know but because i don't use any way then i can do like 30 reps and um, it's hard right it's hard but i try to do until failure because you have to finish the last one kind of like a, you cannot go more like a, you cannot do anymore so that is a way that you know that you're fatigued you muscle and you are working pretty good now i go with uh, uh lunges to the back in a step this is a good and great exercise for hit your glutes and hamstrings go down like at that inclination it have you to to force your hamstring toward to raise your body right you are working your hamstring you are working your glutes also you are working your calf there and of course you call every time that you work any exercise for legs or glutes or upper body you work your core remember so you have really tie your core because all these exercises give you strengthening also in your upper body so i do three sets and also i do a three reps in each leg and it's kind of like it was really hard for me right because i didn't work out for so long but i was also happy to start hitting the gym again kind of like was kind of anxious to to know to to feel i can work with uh weights but i cannot use weights no way i can i feel really uh I, I have a lot of pain in my shoulder in my right shoulder in the side of my neck too i also uh in the beginning when i start working out the gym i also sometimes i start feeling numb in my right side kind of i feel numb my right of my my face my jaw my neck my arm even my leg too so i was kind of really careful like i was really careful to try to heal my muscles but not my body like i i try to be really careful to gonna hold my lesion so these exercises are, are pretty um safe safety uh, for you do that you can do this at the house and also anywhere right i went to the gym because i won't get out from my house but i can do this exercise easily at, at my home so here i do it frontal raises with the band and also i uh, i'm working my legs kind of like my quads there and also i work in my core because i've been so worried about my core lately i feel like i lost a lot of straightening two months and a half without doing any exercise at all nothing uh it was uh kind of like getting me a little weak in my upper body in all my body my, my legs my upper body my core everything was really weak so i try with all this exercise kind of try to hit my glutes my legs and my core now here i do like three sets and i do 30 reps with each leg now i try to hit my obliques i do here also like 30 reps in each side to work my abs a little bit guys thank you for subscribe don't forget to subscribe also give thumbs up to the video give click to the bell so you're gonna receive a notification the next time i post on a video 
And this is all guys. Until the next video. Bye bye.